So I'll be showing you how to add a Google account or a Gmail account to your iPhone 16 or iPhone 16 Pro. Now adding a Google account will give you access to Google services like Gmail, like YouTube and all other services. So you can see, for instance, when you go to YouTube, we don't have an account signed in. OK, and adding a Google account will basically add that Google account to all the Google services, including Gmail. So what you want to do is go ahead and open any Google service. It could be Gmail. It could be Google Home, Google Photos, Google Maps. It doesn't really matter. So I'm just going to open uh, Gmail and then tap on sign in. OK, now once you tap on sign in, tap on add account or add another account. If you already have an account, then that's when you put you tap on add another account. But since I don't have one, I'll just tap on sign in. And then it's going to tell me it wants to use google.com to sign in. Tap on continue. It's going to open that page from where you can sign in with your Google account. If you have your Google account details already saved in the password manager of your iPhone, then you're in luck. If not, then you have to type in the email address and the password. But for me, I'm just going to go ahead and use Face ID to sign in to my Google account like this. And of course, if there's any verification required, you have to do that. And then, as you can see, we are now signed in with this Google account. So you can now tap on done in the top left corner. We are now signed into Gmail. If you go to YouTube and tap on profile and then tap on sign in, then it's going to ask for one of those channels in that account. And I'll just choose any. And now I'm signed in. OK, and I can do that for all the Google products. Let's try and do that on Google Maps, for instance. We are already signed in, actually. And you can switch accounts if you have more than one account. So I'll tap on the profile icon, tap on sign in, choose this account. Just tap on sign in. Well, for some reason, uh, Google Maps is requiring me to sign in again. But since I have my details, I'll just do that. Email address, password, and tap on next. And I'm good to go. So that is basically how to set up a Google account or a Gmail account on your iPhone 16 or iPhone 16 Pro. If you found this video useful, don't forget to leave a like and even subscribe. If you have any comments or questions, feel free to leave them down in the comment section and I'll try and get back to you there or I'll talk to you in the next video. Good luck.